Hello everyone and uh, uh, this, this video will explain uh, why we get uh, this particular error uh, which is on your screen and how to resolve this. So uh, this, this error, let's read out this error once. Uh, it says a VMware workstation and Hyper-V are not compatible. Uh, remove the Hyper-V role uh, from the system before running VMware workstation. So uh, basically what, what is happening here is uh, uh, there are two roles. Uh, one is the Hyper-V role and one is the VMware workstation role and they are, they are getting conflicted. So, uh, so let's see uh, how to resolve this uh, issue. Uh, I have uh, just made a small note here uh, of commands so that we can use it. Uh, so uh, let's uh, we, uh, let's see this first command uh, which says uh, bcd edit and then a back uh, forward slash set hypervisor launch type of so so what does this do uh, this this uh, this command uh, will not uh, uh, enable uh, hyper v uh, as the default uh, hi uh, hypervisor so uh, so let's see how to how to run this command so we need to go to the command prompt and from there we need to go to uh, bcd edit set hypervisor launch type of so uh you can see here uh, I'm not an administrator right now for the uh, command prompt so I need to uh, open this as an uh, administrator let's do that so this is the run as administrator and here we go so I'll run the same command that's uh, bcd edit set hypervisor launch type of so uh, now it says the operation uh, completed successfully. We need to reboot uh, uh, this machine uh, uh, to, for the uh, for the changes to take effect. So I'll pause the video here and uh, we'll get back uh, and check if uh, if this is working. Okay, uh, my system is back up after the reboot and uh, now let's test uh, the VMware workstation after running that command. Uh, we did run that command and uh, uh, it got rebooted. So let's check. So here we'll just select uh, the VMware of our choice and let's uh, try to power it on. And here you go. So uh, this, is, uh, this is the uh, command that you need to use. Uh, I'll, I'll just uh, open up that command for you once again uh, this is working here so you need to you need to uh, uh, disable the hyper V uh, in order to uh, in order to work with the VMware workstation uh, uh, in, in the same environment uh, that you are trying to do so this is the main uh, command that you need to run uh, mm -hmm. that is this is the one so it's a BCD edit uh, forward slash set hypervisor launch type of so and uh, once you if you want to enable the hyper v role again so you, uh, you you can use the following command that is uh, bcd edit forward slash uh, set uh, hypervisor launch type and uh, make it auto in place of off and uh, reboot the computer and you should be all set uh, with the hypervisor hyper v role uh, back again uh, in your uh, uh, machine so this is uh, this is a small uh, uh, tip that you can use if you are facing uh, uh, the conflict error between